put masks over our faces and we love it. We have yeah. to at this point. Yeah, we, it, it is Please. a must. It is a must. <laughs> Getting into our game. We love this. Um, So starting Charge. out, let's see. Oh. Oh wow, he stayed on. He stayed on platform a little bit more than Samus Mage usually do. Like uh, hanging out on top of one is never usually ideal. You were looking for a tech chase among this... those. Samus is looking a little. Uh, he's getting a little aggressive. I mean, no, he's normally not. I would just. I mean, okay. <laughs> this is this is the most for me because all I see Samus is do is just run away. So I mean, I mean, this I'm, is how you gonna... play Samus. I'm gonna be like running away and shooting missiles and charge shot. It may work online. But like actually playing Samus, you need to make people respect you, which is what he's starting to do, which can only make things like a charge shot and super missile that much more effective. Oh, oh wow. Gets gassed. Um, well, he got destroyed. Not destroyed, but that that was just crazy. He's already taking the game 75% and using up out of shield. Um just showing, you know. <laughs> He's, he's probably going to take Glenn and make it so that Glenn, no Glenn. No. Uh, he point. does not have a, he did not have a, oh, he was facing the wrong way, no. He read the roll, or he was looking for the roll, I should say, but Glintendo just took the bomb and said, okay, I'm going to, I'm, I'll take the small hits in order to, to get myself back on stage, but it's kind of crazy how out. much, it's crazy how much stage hazards is making, uh, making Glenn respect just the general Samus area of effect. Her burst range isn't usually considered the greatest as long as she doesn't have charge shot, given how she's so floaty. Mm -hmm. But the amount of respect Glenn is giving him is only making charge, only making stage hazard that much more comfortable moving around uh, these platforms and moving around in Glenn's face. I wonder if up there would have killed. Uh, not at the percent it was, I don't think. But anything at this point will kill, you know. And we see down here coming out from Glencendo. I mean, anything could happen at this point. Are we gonna see a good, oh. Not really that much of a good combo, but I mean, um, Glenn looking like he's starting to try and put in the aggressive learns that he wants to. <laughs> um, and gets upbeat out of shield. I'm surprised that didn't kill, right. but we have the charge shot killing. He tried and... to clank with it with a blade beam. That was his answer to an almost full charge shot. It's like, oh, I'll just throw my blade beam at it. Like, no, no Glenn. <laughs> Dan are going to come through hard to challenge and uh, stage has definitely has learned his lesson from the his first stock lost. Very nice grab. I really love how, um, you know, stage hazard is doing really well with these um, ledge trapping situations that he's given. Now, are we going to see a kill from Glenn? I mean, he has limit, but he needs to use blade. Before. He's going to use blade beam probably at the uh, right. Oh, he oh. was a little bit too <laughs> late. It would suck because limit blade beam would have caught ledge and at this percent would have killed as well. So that's a huge stock loss for Glenn, but the dash attack sweeps it up. Okay, he's playing a lot more grounded. He's keeping his, uh, his feet to the floor and making full use of the uh, not only climb hazard, but things like dash attack and up smash to catch a lot more landings. He knows stage hazard is usually going to end up going to the air if they want to be aggressive. Still, damage is starting to rack nice. up. Good use of blade beam to get back to stage. Uh, transcendent properties would have gone through any ha any uh, item or projectile that stage hazard would have thrown out to try and cover ledge. Okay, I mean, this is honestly already tight at this point. You know, Down. Glenn is doing a really good job at just trying to make this comeback and very had a very good ledge trapping situation there, but kind of um, flubbed it a little bit. But all Glenn yeah. really needs is probably just a really nice uh, read, and he can probably take this set. I'm just... waiting for the frame trap that Glenn has been like pretty setting up to do, but then not doing it. <laughs> he's, he's double jump back airing, double jump like forward air. That baits the air dodge, but he's not punishing the air dodge. He's Plus instead of letting stage hazard, hazard just... You know, just get back to ledge. Oh, wow. Barely missing that blade beam. And wow. All of no these jump. things feel oh, like yes. they're just sad. Go out and hit cloud. That's what okay, he looked a little bit pressured towards the end. And in fact, there was a ton of pressure towards the end of that game. Nintendo was making a furious comeback, playing a ton of neutral. But 
Stage Hazard said, when in doubt, put Cloud off stage because all it takes is one pebble in the wrong spot and Cloud is a, Cloud's a goner. Particularly charging limit right there. Charging limit to get back to ledge is good. Charging limit that close, not so much. <laughs> Stage I Hazard was think you ready to go. That if I remember correctly as well. Oh, the bomb might have hit him as well, but normally Sour Spot Downer doesn't send that far, but... I mean, getting into the second game, um, you know, Glenn Tech needs to... Oh, no, no, no. It was techable. It was techable. It was techable? It was techable. It was techable. Let's see what Glenn Sendo's gonna do to probably and try to make this a little better and more favorable position. Very nice catching the air dodge and not really Almost. catching the uh Oh you're dead? Don't oh <laughs> well that was um, The power of Samus up air, ladies and gentlemen, and very pristine on stage hatter to to recognize that hey i can reset my jump on this platform and get the kill if gun doesn't do anything i don't believe getting the second into the third up air was true but if you don't do anything then mm -hmm. no nah, you didn't get it he didn't platform wasn't close enough he's still hunting for these up airs though he's trying to <laughs> recreate the magic <laughs> it wouldn't be surprised if he probably just killed with up b for the rest of the stocks at this point <laughs> <laughs> He's hunting. Beaver's back. No, he gave away the chance to double jump back air, which would have been a hefty risk for more charge on the on the charge beam. That was up uh, tilt. Getting a little scary there. Yeah, you know, he's playing this slow. He's playing it as he should, and absolutely watching out for any limit that it's coming out from uh, from Gintendo. Stalling out the timer, it's only 15 seconds, and you can you can hang out on ledge for as long as you want if you're Samus. Ledge is absolutely home, and, and one of the few characters that can use the ledge as an offensive position, not just a defensive position. Very uh, nice back air, but not going to take it just yet. Already 162 to 85%. I mean, Glenn needs to take the stock now before, you know, he finds himself in a second stock. Or in, in his in his last stock, you know, trying to make a two stock comeback. Oh, go out there and hit him. He tried. He tried. It it's oh, minute, but great wow. fastball. Though it does not matter. <laughs> and Sage has it hold on to his lead. And and holding shield. Yeah, Cod's not gonna kill you with any grab at this point. You can hold shield and wait for wait for the back airs or and wait for Glenn to do something unsafe as he's been doing. Not again. Okay. <laughs> Whew. It's almost the two hundred percent again. <laughs> Now, how Glenn came back in the in game one, it was structured in a very, in not a, it wasn't fast. He played a lot of neutral with Stage Hazard and caught a lot of the air dodges that Stage Hazard had been throwing out. However, with that habit kind of shored up a little bit and being more very aggressive nice. off of ledge, that's just it. Yeah, he didn't miss the tech and that's gonna be, that's gonna do it. <laughs> it's gonna be game 2-0. And now we just have to wait for the Glintendo tweet. Uh, yeah, keep an eye on your Twitter at <laughs> Super <Glintendo. laughs> We're waiting. Yeah, but it's far too late for any uh, any lag checks or anything of the like. He just has to hold the 2-0 and try his best in losers if he doesn't DQ. Hopefully he don't. We don't like to see DQs here. We like to see everybody coming out here and everybody donating to the Macharino. Typing exclamation point Macharino in chat. Wow. 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 By doing your part, wow. you can make it 